guys welcome back this is Miss Lauren Lee 11 and today I'm going to be showing you how I do my protective style for natural hair in the summer challenge okay now the reason why it's a challenge is because I hate wearing my hair in protective style so even now my hubby said it looks cute but I think I look I look young already as you can tell <laughs> but I think it makes me look even younger so I kind of struggle having my hair in a protective style so this will be a challenge because I'm going to be trying to keep my hair in a protective style two weeks out of the month so not two weeks straight I'm gonna break it up give my hair a rest I'm gonna have seven days in protective style then I'm gonna have like maybe wear a bun or have my hair out and then I'm gonna have another seven days so it's 14 days out of the month up until Christmas I'm gonna try guys I'm gonna try because I want to get some length now so if you want to join me on this challenge feel free to let me know how your challenge is going and you can also let me know on uh instagram at miss lauren lee 11 facebook miss lauren lee 11 or you can just leave your your challenge how your challenge is going if you are doing it down below in the comment section okay guys don't forget to like subscribe and all the jazz and just continue watching the video bye so right now i'm just going to be separating my hair as i usually do getting it ready for deep conditioning and I'm going to do it in four sections. So here is the Elasta QP deep conditioner. I've done a video review on this before so you guys would be familiar with this if you've watched those videos. And I'm going to start the application from the ends of my hair and work my way up to the roots. So here is the front section of my hair and I'm just showing you how dry colouring does make your hair guys. That's why it's so important to deep condition and I'm going to aim to deep condition twice a week. So I'm going to twist that all up so the deep conditioner can penetrate every strand of my hair. And then I'm going to leave it pinned up for about 30 to 45 minutes. Hey guys, so my hair's been fully deep conditioned with my Elasta QP and I'm just gonna veer off the subject a little guys. I just want to talk to you guys while I'm doing this. So whilst my hair was deep conditioning for about half an hour, I was watching Jada Pinkett's Red Table Talks on Facebook. Just let me know guys, what do you guys think? I absolutely love Jada and I've been her fan for like literally years. But I love the fact that she's got such a positive but real life experiences type of show going on and I like the fact that they're so open so anyway guys I digress right guys so before I apply anything to my hair my hair as I said my hair is fully deep conditioned I'm just gonna do a nice straight part because as I mentioned I'm going to be doing Dutch braids as my protective style so I just want to make sure, I'm not really too fussed about my parting down the back. I mean, my hair is usually always split down the middle anyway, so I usually get quite a good parting. So now I'm going to moisturize my hair with, I won't be using palms today. I'm going to be using a cream of nature. And the reason why I'm using this one is because it is actually a leave-in milk and it's moisture recovery. I'm trying to impart as much moisture into my hair so when it is in the protective style, you know, when it's time for my hair to be taken down from that protective style, I'm going to then go back and deep condition. So basically I want to make sure my hair through the protective style is always moisturized. When it's out of the protective style, it's still moisturized. So I'm gonna go ahead and use my wide tooth comb, to comb guys. I'm just gonna start on the ends. And guys, I'm gonna go old school today to seal this in because it is a protective style and I won't be, my hair won't be moving all over the place and getting all over my clothes. I'm going to be using good old fashioned hair grease, which is my Dax. Right, so before I use my Aunt Jackie's elongating gel, just gonna quickly seal it. Preferably the ends. Where my hair's colored. Grease my scalp as I usually would. So right guys, what I'm gonna do next, take my Aunt Jackie's gel, smooth it down on all the parts that I want to lay flat. 
so guys there are so many tutorials I think I've even done one quite a while back of how to Dutch braid but um, so this isn't a tutorial of how to braid this is literally a tutorial of my protective style for the summer guys Okay, and this is going to be left in for seven days then as I said I'm going to take it out co-wash my hair because the whole point is impart as much moisture and retain as much moisture as possible obviously healthy hair makes long hair <laughs> so I'm going to co-wash the next time I take my hair out so I'm gonna I'm gonna try and clarify once a month I'm so used to clarifying my hair with a shampoo now rather than co-washing but I'm going to try and go back to the co-washing for a little bit because I did see some growth and uh, health in my hair. You know, you got to get them baby hairs down. <laughs> okay, so this is what I've ended up with. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do the other side and I'll come back to you once it's completed, guys. going to seal the ends with the Dax okay guys so that will be my summer protective style for 2018 so let's recap I'll be wearing it for 14 days out of the month so not 14 days straight I'll have it for seven days like this then I'll co-wash and then I'll maybe wear it in a bun or maybe wear it out from time to time and then after that for the last seven days however many days but it's got to be in that month I will wear it for another seven days and then at the beginning of the next month I will then clarify rather than co-wash and then I'll continue to co-wash each week and what have you so guys if you have any questions if you have any comments leave them down below in the comments box don't forget to like and subscribe um, thank you guys so much for watching and Follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram and I'll see you in the next video guys. Thank you. Bye.